go for time. Time. Go for time. Your team is doing pretty decently this year. And how are the Rangers doing? <laughs> Not, Not so, so good. Well. Second to last in our division. We're in the Jack. Uh, we're, we're in the Hughes sweepstakes. Who's who? Do you, uh, predictions? Who do you think is going to win the cup this year? Slash, how far is your team going to make it? Not, Who's going to the not, cup? Not the Rangers. Yeah, not the Rangers. The Rangers won't be in the Rangers. playoffs yeah, uh, for the first, but for the first time in a while, right? Yeah, I mean, they were in the playoffs seven years in a row or something like that. Seven up until years, last year, up until like last that. year. Was it two cups or one cup that they went to? I know they didn't win. They but. went to one cup. Okay. They made an Eastern Conference final as well. Yeah. So. And they've won one in 78 years, I think. 94? Yeah. But it was a beautiful cup. It was a beautiful cup. <laughs> beautiful cup. They had to bring in five or six Edmonton Oilers at the trade deadline. Right. No more trash on each other's team. To bring great. the cup to New York City, which is a great thing, but that, that's what they had to do. You guys had a good run, that, that you know, your I'll 80s give you, run. I'll give you one thing, which is a really, really all Islander fans should be proud of this. And uh, no basketball team has done this. No baseball team has done this. I think, I don't even know if the Connecticut women have done this, but the Islanders, in their glory, Days that won 19 playoff series in a row. Wow. That's, that's one of the records, which is crazy. Yeah. I don't think they'll there, be there was one, uh, 19 week. playoff that's series insane. in a row. There was one week on the show that we did the best sports franchises ever, and, and you yeah. you mentioned that. But wait, so I do want to get your predictions. Though. Who's going to the Cup this year and who's winning? No, you go first. Go ahead. Go it's ahead. hard to bet against Tampa Bay right now because every time they step on the ice, they have something that I haven't seen in a very long time. Dangerous intent. They want to <laughs> win every single game in every statistical category. That's awesome. It's fantastic. Now, whether or not their goaltending can hold up in the playoffs remains to be seen. That's the question. But I think what's going to help Tampa, and is, they're the clear favorite in the East, the West, especially with the trade deadline today, everybody loaded up today out West. Shift. I mean, Vegas made a couple of great deals. They picked up Stone uh, today. Uh, Nashville picked up Wayne Simmons. Uh, Winnipeg picked up Kevin Hayes, your guy. It's going to be a bloodbath out West. So I think the team that makes the finals <laughs> that comes out of the West is going to literally going to be a beaten, exhausted team. And if it's if Tampa has an easy time of it in the East, which they may, they may have an easy time if they continue to play this well. But again, like Steve said, is Vasilevsky has he has, has he, he done it in a play? Yet. Who's going to so give Tampa a run key. for the money in the East? Uh, Honestly, the Islanders could. Yeah. If we they, played well against them this year so far. They're the only team that really pushes, that, that can push the pace. They're dangerous on the wing. They find ways, but we talked about it. The power play is the issue. That's the issue. So We've beat them two out of three times, low scoring games. What's uh, the issue with the power play? It just can't. We just we don't score in a power <laughs> play. It, it's the same thing that the Rangers have had for the past few years. They're waiting for the perfect shot. It, it doesn't exist. They're not creating opportunities. So, They're passing so, the puck too much. So they, base, they don't have a lot of shots on goal Just during get the, the pucks power to the play. Net. Because I've have watched my fair share of hockey, even though I'm not an expert, and I, I even an, an amateur like myself can tell when because I see during the power plays a lot of these teams there. They're setting it up. They're setting it up for a minute and a half, and they end up getting one or two shot attempts. And it's no, you gotta get well, you live ten blocks away from me. I'm sure you hear me every night <laughs> yelling from ten blocks away. Shoot the puck! Shoot the puck! <laughs> Good <laughs> things happen when you shoot the puck. Yeah. For some teams, that works. Most teams, it does not. Yeah. Most teams cannot. You got to put pucks on the net. You have to create opportunities. Good things happen when you with, throw the puck out with the Wayne net. Simmons. You, you just mentioned that's a guy who creates his own opportunities. He stands in front of the net. He goes to the to the corners. He gets to the puck to the net as fast as he can. Would have been a nice fit for us today, Would but have been a great uh, fit. but Lou didn't want to give up a, a couple of our young assets, and I don't blame him. Smart. I don't blame him. Not preparing for, for the fu preparing for the future or sustainability now yeah. with Tavares being gone and well, he's returning soon and I will be there Thursday night yeah. we don't need you will be the chant that uh, I don't know if I may start it but someone will